Hello everyone, this is Kiki. Welcome to our new video series, Exploring Injection Molding Defects. In this episode, we will learn about one of the most common injection molding defects, flash. What is flash? Flash or flashing is excess plastic that forms on the surface of injection molded parts. This defect happens when some liquid plastic leaks from the mold cavity, pores, and hardens with the rest of the components, forming a tap, flap, or protrusion. Flash is usually found near ceiling faces, party lines, ejectors, or venting channels. So, why does flash happen? There are several common reasons. 1. Insufficient climbing pressure. 2. Misalignment of parting lines. 3. Improper venting. 4. High plastic temperature. Let's analyze them one by one. 1. Insufficient climbing pressure. It refers to in mode pressure exceeds climbing pressure. When plastic is injected, it creates pressure inside the mold. The plastic is injected, the higher the pressure in the mold. If in mode pressure exceeds the climbing pressure, the mold halves can separate slightly, allowing the plastic to seep out, resulting in flash. To address this, you should confirm if the holding pressure and the climbing pressure are appropriate. Additionally, be mindful that high holding pressure can cause an increase in the pressure inside the mold. 2. Misalignment of parting lines. This occurs when there is a misalignment between the mold halves. Pressure can differ the mold surfaces and one mold won't fit tightly together. Contaminants like dust or dirt can also prevent proper closure of the mold. 3. Improper venting. Venting channels are usually positioned on the outside of the molding parting line to allow gas to escape. If the venting channels are too deep, they can cause flash. For example, with PS plastic, the vent depth is typically around 0.02 mm. If it's set to 0.04 mm, flash will occur. 4. High plastic temperature. When the plastic melt temperature is too high, its viscosity decreases, making it more fluid. This increases the required climbing force. If the climbing force is insufficient, gaps can form, leading to flash. So, how can you locate the cause of flash? Let's get some troubleshooting tips. When flash happens, first check if the holding pressure surpasses the climbing pressure in the injection parameters. Then perform short shots and holding pressure tests to pinpoint mold issues. For instance, try a 60 to 90% short shot with the product not sticking to the mold to check for flash. If no flash appears, gradually increase the holding pressure and observe the outcome. If flash occurs during the short shot, it could be due to parting line mismatches or inadequate venting. Such an analysis of flash defects and their solutions. If you need professional assistance with your project, our expert injection molding team is here to help. Contact us now. If you find this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up and share it. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel for future updates. Stay tuned for more videos and I'll see you next time.